A massive show of support to say no to the possible closure of two London fire stations. 2,000 firefighters from around the country rallied outside brigade headquarters as fire chiefs decided the future of stations at Shooters Hill and the Barbican. Among the crowd of protesters, Shooters Hill firefighter Peter Roach, his father and son. As a station, it's uh, originally had two appliances there. It's already been cut back to one. If there's no fire station up there, it's leaving a big gap with no fire cover. Those fears are also felt by colleagues at the Barbican. If we close, there won't be any redundancies, but these guys are going to be pushed off all around the brigade, and that expertise and knowledge of the city will be lost. Meeting on the ninth floor, brigade bosses say the two stations may need to close in order to meet a spending shortfall of £10 million this year. The fire brigade union says it disagrees and has drawn up its own budget, claiming both stations can be saved. We still believe that they can set their budget this year, keep all the stations open and still leave a sufficient amount in reserves. And we would welcome a joint campaign with them to put our case to the government so that for next year and for future years they get their funding on a proper footing. Members are currently being balloted on possible strike action if the cuts were to happen. This show of solidarity demonstrates the true depth of feeling by London's firefighters. If they decide to strike, the Green Goddesses could be on the streets by the middle of next month. Ian War, Channel One, at London Fire Brigade Headquarters.